And next pack. Oh, uh, yes. Yes. That is where I want to be. This looks like it's number 198. This looks like it is... Oh, 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 oh. that's a hit. There's a 1981 ACDC right there. Wow. There we go. That is a hit right there. ACDC card. 42 years old. Fresh out of the pack. Card number 198 of the Disco Rama set from Panini. Wow. That is a great one. I love it. Really happy to pull that. I didn't even know this was a thing. All right, so today we're going to be breaking into some packs of 1981 Disco Rama. And these are, it's a Panini pack. And what these are is they're little square album covers. The Panini put these out 42 years ago. I have 12 packs from that we're going to open. There are four cards in each pack. I'll show you what some of the cards look like. And they're really pretty cool. And some of them are pretty, uh, pretty sought after. Uh, I opened up three packs of them recently in a... And when I got these in the mail, uh, during the mail video... And this is the, uh, hopefully I don't get a glare on this. This is the Genesis one. There's Genesis from their Duke album. And this is Rod Stewart. Now that's actually like a silver chrome around the edge there. So it's not just ink. It's like a, it's like a chrome around there. And then here is a, um, here's a Carly Simon album right here. And those were out of the uh, three packs that I did. There were a total of 12 cards I got out of three packs. And these are just three of them here. That's what the back looks like right there. So these are these are really cool. Some of the better ones in there uh, that would be sought after would be like, for instance, Bob Marley, Grateful Dead, uh, Hendrix, Led Zeppelin, Kiss, uh, Pink Floyd, Fleetwood Mac, ACDC, let me see if I'm forgetting anything. There's there's actually two Hendrixes in there. There's a Van Halen in there, which is actually a very early Van Halen. Um, I think the Van Halen 1980 Samler Saker is their first card. This would be their second one, which makes it pretty good in my eyes. So uh, with that, um, it's they're, they're little. They're about two and a half inches by two and a half inches or roughly six and a half centimeters by six and a half centimeters. So they're not real big, and uh, let's get right into them. Uh, we're gonna open. I'm not gonna be saving the wrappers or anything like that because it would be impossible. I, I, I the first three I did, these are well sealed. Uh, you can. It does have a little bit of a translucent uh, paper here, so like you can see, it's a little bit translucent. You can actually see through to the back card and possibly even see the number of it. Um, I can't see through the fronts well, and I can't make out any of these of what they'd be on the front, so that makes them uh, pretty much you'd only know what the back card is on that, and that and since there's four in here, that makes it a fair shot there. So let's go ahead and uh, I'll put these aside right here. And let's go ahead and start opening these up and see who we get. And I just have to basically tear into them. And they do kind of stick to... I'm going to peel the paper off like this too. Because they do, do kind of stick to it sometimes. That one came out pretty easy there. So... Let's see what we've got here. Yeah, this is a, it's a, it's an Italian or something like that. I can't even tell who this is right here. 
George Benson. There's George Benson there. Jenny Ila Bambola. Not familiar with uh, Jenny. And the last one is Yes. That is a, a Yes album. Yes songs. And that's a pretty cool one right there. Let's see what the condition is of this. It has kind of a kind of a roll in it right here. So this wouldn't be a perfect card. Um, if that was a really big one, I, 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 I'm glad it's on a yes card and not a really big one there. So there we go. That's pack one. Let's look at pack two. I'm trying not to get it too close to these cards. I don't want to ruin the edges at all. Okay. First one, uh, Steven Schlack's Third Melody. And the Rolling Stones. Very nice. There's the Rolling Stones right there. Rolling Stones. Very cool. Uh, another one I'm not familiar with. Le Orme. That's Italian. And then this one here is, looks like Patti Smith. That's Patti Smith, that's pretty cool right there. There's some light on it so you can see it. And there's Patti Smith. I like these. I think these are really cool. I will. Uh, I would buy these again. These were pretty reasonably priced. If I get any one of those ones that I named before, uh, that would be awesome. That would uh, make this all worth a, a worthwhile round trip. Uh, like they had, the the one I'm really after obviously is uh, the Grateful Dead that's really just a really big one and Alan Surrendon I am just not familiar with a lot of these Vander Graaf generator Eve Montan. And this one is number 28. Who is that? Card's in pretty good shape. Oh, Susie and the Banshees. And no matter what set I break, I get Susie and the Banshees. No matter what set I break. Okay, next one. So small, I can barely see them. I'm gonna use this magnifier I have here. Oh, Linda Ronstadt. Yeah, I should have recognized the album there. Look at there's Linda Ronstadt right there. That's a good one for me. I'm a Linda Ronstadt collector. There's not a lot of Linda, Linda Ronstadt out there, and here's a nice 1981 card. 42 years old. There's Linda. Franco Califano. Franco. Uh, Senni e Concini. Yeah. And this is 114. The Cure. Okay. This is 
there's the cure right there. That's a good one. And next pack. Oh, uh, yes! Yes! That is where I want to be. This looks like it's number 198. This looks like it is... Oh, that's a hit. There's a 1981 ACDC right there. Wow. There we go. That is a hit right there. ACDC card, 42 years old, fresh out of the pack. Card number 198 of the Disco Rama set from Panini. Wow, that is a great one. I love it. Really happy to pull that. I'm gonna put that one aside. That one's my best one so far. And this could all end right now and I'd be, I'd be fine with all of this. And Lips Incorporated, Francesco Guccini, and Gloria Gaynor. Gloria right there. All right, look at my ACDC there. Wow. That is incredible. Just beautiful. as it gets right there. Okay. These are coming out in pretty nice shape. A couple of them had that little roll on the back like I thought there. This says, this says Barkley James Harvest. 31 and that one is Alberto Camerini oh, oh, oh there's a nice Carol King right there that's tapestry look at that Carol King tapestry that's awesome that's a great one I like that there's Carol King right there good one and this is wings I think this is wings over America yeah that looks like wings over America right there so that's Paul McCartney let's take a look here There's Paul McCartney right there in wings I'm really enjoying these. I like these. Too bad you just can't go out and buy these anytime you want them. This is an item that someone has to decide they want to let go and then you have to be there to get them. Okay, I'm having a hard time with this one. Try not to bend them. is Pierre Angelo Bertoli the music okay not one I'm gonna know Creedence Clearwater Revival Susie Q wow there you go CCR that's a nice one there love it there's CCR right there CCR and then we have, in number six, is Alberto Forless. Yeah, I don't know that one. And here's 10cc, one I'm familiar with. There's 
there's 10 cc right there still very excited about my ACDC up top there Dala, P A L L A, Dala. Yeah. Here's the Bee Gees. Best of the Bee Gees. Best of the Bee Gees. Nella Tanoni. And Teresa Dicio. Number 75. Okay. Central de la Musica. That is Ron, it says Ron. Card number 160. Here's another Genesis. So I've got two Genesis now. Very nice. That's good. Jackson Brown. There's Jackson Brown. That's card number 21. And that is running on empty. And it's actually in really nice shape. There's no problems with it. Frank Zappa, hot rats. There's Frank Zappa. A lot of you are going to remember a lot of these album covers better than me. But uh, I know the artists, I just really don't have all the album covers memorized like a lot of people do. Uh, here's a Frank Zappa again, right on the front. Frank Zappa Hot Rats, there's two of those. Rod Stewart, the best of the best. There's Rod. Rod Stewart, the best of the best. Alberto Portis, Portis? That looks like, I think that's Gloria Gaynor. 124. Now let's go to page two. 124 is Gloria Gaynor. I kind of like me. There we go. Let's 
programa. love okay here is uh, that looks like Tom Jones There's no name on it that has to be Tom Jones there Jacques Brel no Jacques and Hulberry. Here we go. Last chance for the big hit in this opening. Okay, we had this one before. This was uh, Parangelo Bertoli. Oh, Ray Charles. There's Ray. That's very cool. Let's see if I got two of them here. Yeah, we do. There we go. Oh, there's a third Genesis, too. There's Ray. Ray Charles and here's my third Genesis <laughs> Duke oh Van Halen sweet very nice Van Halen wow oh my gosh card 210 let's look this up show you that Let's go to 210. Apes 3. 210. Van Halen. Fair warning. Wow. There's Van Halen. Fair warning. There's the back of it right there. I had I got two cards on my hot list. Got Van Halen and ACDC, and believe me, those Genesis cards are no slouch either. There's, there's a Van Halen right there. All right. So there we go. Um, that was that was a, a lot of fun for these 12 packs here, and we did get a couple of good hits out of it. We got the ACDC. Uh, we got a Van Halen, and we did get three Genesis total. I had one from before, but two more. So this Genesis Duke, uh, I've got three of these now, and that's nice to have. Uh, a couple of Frank Zappas. Uh, we did get, who else did we get here? We got uh, Creedence Clearwater Revival. So yeah, we got some. we got some pretty good stuff here. Very excited about these. These are really cool. Old Panini cards, 42 years old. And uh, yeah, just uh, stay tuned and we'll be opening a lot more stuff in the near future. Thanks a lot. I want to thank you for watching this video today. I hope you enjoy watching all of the Collecting Music Cards videos as they're posted. If you think you may want to learn more about music cards and tips for collecting them, and if you're looking forward to more videos in this series, take a second to hit the subscribe button and click the notification bell as well if you want notifications that a new video has posted. If you'd like to take a peek at some of my personal music card collection online, you can find it on my website at www.cardboardportfolio.com. And if you're excited about being part or becoming part of the music card collecting community, please leave a comment down below. I'd love to see what you have to say, and I'm sure others would too. Until next time, thanks for stopping by.